welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we have a little bit of like everything kind of going on in this video. Just have a few topics I want to discuss, showcase some things, and just a little bit of everything like that. If you guys checked out our community tab the other day, I posted on the community tab talking about MDT or My Damn Toys style merch or themed merch. You know, I was thinking in my head to do, that I wanted to do something for the holiday season. Like if you guys wanted to, I don't know, grab maybe one of your kids something or, or you wanted to grab yourself something or you wanted to put it on your list or whatever the case was maybe you would want to do so so I asked you guys if you guys would like some merch and it seemed like a, a decent amount of you did want some so I'm in the process of making that happen I'm trying to get it done before Christmas we'll see about that if it's not in time for Christmas maybe it'll be in time right at the new year or just after the new year still working on those things trying to get designs made and little mock-ups and stuff so the ideas that I had in my head that uh, I, I definitely want to do some sort of graphic t-shirt I don't know like I don't want to just do you know just a regular shirt with the logo I'd like it to be a little bit more creative than that, you know, get into the MDT themes and stuff. Would you guys want it to have something to do with the pick fed? You know, like I even designed up a hoodie that had like MDT Elite Champion on the front. It was like a blue hoodie and it had like the Elite Champion graphic on it. Or maybe you, like, I don't know if you guys would be interested in a pink hoodie with MDT stuff on it. I don't know if you wanted like a white hoodie or, or black or whatever the case is, man. I'm trying to play with some designs and stuff like that. I'm trying to get the creative juices flowing. But I also wanted to do, like I wanted to have a shirt, like at least one shirt design at least one hoodie design and then I wanted to do a jersey you guys know that I'm a big sports fan I love sports I love football I love basketball and I would probably even do a baseball jersey eventually like I'm thinking in my mind I want to do like a basketball jersey possibly a football jersey and then a baseball jersey eventually down the line but I'm kind of trying to play with some different designs in my head I have a, a jersey over here to my right that's not like MDT themed or anything like that it's just kind of an example or a mock-up of maybe if you guys would be interested you guys can still stick around and see, but let me know what you guys think about that. It's something I've been messing around with. I kind of wanted to do a play on like John Cena's merch and kind of mix that and like kind of parody that. You guys can let me know what you think down in the comment section below about all those things, but I wanted to get on here and talk about that and just if you guys have any background in graphic design, if anybody out there watching, or just let me know. If, you, if you're interested in some MDT merch, whether it be a shirt, a hoodie, a jersey, if you guys would rock it or you just would like to help out the channel in some way or something like that, that would be greatly appreciated but you guys just let me know. Whatever, you know, I want to be a fan service. I want to do things that you guys would like to buy, and I want to buy something. Like, I don't want to just have merch that's just, you know, whatever. I want it to mean something. I want it to be special, and it's probably going to be in limited quantity. I don't, I want it to be like a special deal, and I want it to be something that you guys love and something that I would wear myself. So all those different things I'm playing with. I even had the idea of doing some trading cards with maybe like some, some rare like variants or something like that, like some one of fives and some different things like that. I I don't know. I'm just still working through those things in my brain and everything, but you guys can let me know all your thoughts and ideas down in the comment section below, and maybe that'll help us along the way as we progress through this idea. But what I also wanted to talk about was not only the jersey, which I'll show in just a moment, but Ringside Collectibles posted up their Black Friday 2.0 sale. Actually really good. Like when they first did it, you know, they every single year they do this. They do the Black Friday 1.0 or just the Black Friday. Then they do their Cyber Monday. Then they'll do a Black Friday sale 2.0, which is live right now. And I want I want to say they're, they're even going to do a 3.0 later on, but there's no guarantees on that. So you may want to strike while the iron's hot. You can use promo code MDTOYS to save yourselves 10% when doing all of those things. But they actually have some pretty damn good stuff on there. And I'll go ahead and cut over to the screen and take you guys through that and showcase exactly what I'm talking about. So as you guys can see, we do have the Black Friday sale 2.0 right here going on. And just getting into some of this, man, like they have some pretty good figures on sale right here. A little bit of Elite 87 going on. Like like, I know that the Otis figure, like, I, he's still in the company. He's definitely still in the company, but it's kind of weird. Like, $7.99 for that figure, double-jointed arms, all those things. $6.99 for the Io Shirai, one of the better women's figures of last year for $6. $9.99 Braun Strowman, double-jointed arms, all the good stuff here. You got John Morrison for $10.99, Edge Elite for $10. Like, there's some really good deals on here that I think you should get. A Drew McIntyre Elite for $6.99, really far above and away from the $80 Drew McIntyre of a couple years ago or whatever that was so that's kind of crazy too but this is a great time to get in on any figures that you missed a b any fodder or custom stuff that you want to get in on this is a, a perfect opportunity to do those things $14.99 for the Elite 83 Edge right there. Keith Lee Elite 82 figure right there. Uh, just some really good stuff going on. Riho still hanging on at $16.99, but there's just a lot of good stuff here. Dexter Loomis for $5.99. This figure right here, if you guys missed out on this Bray Wyatt, it's kind of 
kind of garb, to be honest, but you know, it's there if you want to grab it. Uh, Liv Morgan, Titus O'Neil for $9.99. I literally just got that for 11 at Big Lots, so that hurts my feelings. Ultimate Edition Edge over here, Jerry the King, you know, did just some pretty good steals right here. $11.99 for the fan takeover, Seth Rollins. So again, you just want to scroll through here. I would get on here and look through what they have. $8.99, Elite 85, Bray Wyatt. You got some AEW in here, probably still not a great cash grab as far as like the AEW figures are concerned. $13.99 for Elite 86 Seth Rollins. You have some different exclusives on here, which is pretty interesting to say the least. I wonder if anybody will order this MJF and actually get a chase variant from ordering right there. Maybe you could order five and possibly get one. I wouldn't, I don't know if it would happen, but it's it's worth like at least adding two to the cart, you know, like add two to the cart, just see if you get one. I, I mean, what, are the, what goes through the mind of these people when they're packing the boxes up, you know what I'm saying? But you got some pretty good stuff on here. Again, you even have like brand new figures on here that have dropped like seven dollars or so for like these brand new elites so that's something this is one that i'm definitely gonna grab i'm probably about to place an order here in a minute here's nyla rose maybe you can get the chase variant there but this chase variant pink and gray keith lee for 14.99 i'm absolutely gonna cash in on that when i get an opportunity probably gonna place an order here in a moment but this is something this is a figure that i missed out on i definitely want that in my collection i uh, gotta get the gray and pink gear i think it's his best elite by far 12.99 for elite 84 buddy murphy i guess it's because he has that monday night messiah gimmick going but great <laughs> More Keith Lee Elite right here, Survivor Series 14.99. I don't like those haven't even hit retail yet, and they're already below retail. So that may be something you want to get right there. You got MJF Unrivaled Series 6. You got John Morrison Elite Survivor Series for 8.99 right there. Kofi Kingston. So I mean, another way you could do this is if you go to the top of the page, you could even hit like sort it by lowest price, and then you can get some figure stands for 2.49. You know, if you want to have the Kyle Peterson treatment, you get some old retros on here. If you want a custom those some basics for crowd members like you could literally come up here and put 10 of these damn drew mcintyres in there and then put some shirts and heads on them and make a crowd member for really cheap so just some different things to think about when you're trying to you know go through here and and get on here and try to figure out some things that you may want to do scarlet get this figure right now get the full body suit scarlet right now for five dollars and put that head sculpt on the new elite coming out i'm probably gonna you know i'm probably going to repaint the eyes of the new figure but that's still something you may want to do you can load up on the deluxe stretcher you have announce tables you could cash in on like great accessories right here for really cheap a fiend elite for six dollars i mean bro i know like since we're getting into double jointed arms and stuff it's kind of hard to do but there is an absolute spot for all of these figures man there's an absolute deal to be made here gronk for 8.99 i still believe in my heart that this figure is going to shoot up in price one day and everybody's going to you're going to think i was nuts until it happens but i'm probably going to grab a couple of these more since a great time to get some classic SmackDown Tag Team Championships. You grab a couple of those for 20 bucks. You get two John Morrisons and the two titles. Maybe you could use the Morrisons for other things and keep the titles and sell the Morrisons. So, I don't know. Again, think outside the box when you're getting in collecting, man. Plenty of other options on here. Bobby Heenan I missed out on. So, I'm definitely going to get on here and play around and just try to find some stuff to purchase. No doubt about it. But, these are things that I wanted to talk about and get on here and show you guys just in case you missed out on it. But, throwing it back to myself on camera now. So anyways, guys, as you guys can see, Ringside Collectibles has some pretty good stuff going on. Again, you can use code MDTOYS to save an additional 10%. And I want to show you guys this jersey real quick to kind of get like an idea of what I'm talking about. I saw a lot of people say they would be interested in a jersey, so that's really awesome. Like you guys, I guess you couldn't tell me like, would you rather, would you prefer a football, basketball, or baseball jersey? I feel like basketball to start off and then we can change it to football just because those are my two main sports. I like to wear baseball jerseys. However, I think to start off, we'll go with like a basketball or football. Let's just shut the hell up and get into the jersey. So as you guys can see, this is about what it would look like, at least an idea of what it would look like. Like, this is screen printed on there. This isn't embroidered or anything. This is like a, uh, just a, a regular jersey. This is probably the same company I would order it from. This is reversible. Ours would not be reversible. It would probably just be, you know, one simple jersey there. But this is kind of the idea behind it. So you'd have whatever graphics on there. You'd have the number and then whatever, like some logos, stuff like that. And then it would just have like a collar design and an edge design like that. And you could throw it over a hoodie. You could wear a t-shirt under it. You could rock the jersey by yourself. You go 
shooting hoop in it. I don't care. That will be up to you guys, but that's kind of an example of what it would look like. This is kind of what the MDT color blue looks like. I don't know what it would look like with like the MDT logos on there and stuff, but this is just kind of an idea that I had. But you guys can let me know down in the comment section below what you think, but I definitely want to have t-shirts, hoodies, and potentially a jersey made. Still working on the process, like I said, but any cool ideas, I would greatly appreciate it. Anyways, guys, that's pretty much going to wrap up today's video. I know kind of like a vloggy kind of random thing, but I wanted to get on here, talk about the ringside sale, and also talk about the merch idea and everything like that. But that's going to wrap up today's video, man. Thank you guys so very much for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy. Let me know all of your thoughts down in the comment section below. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok at my damn toys. and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you, and don't cross the line like me if I don't get some merch made. You cross the line, I've been